brought to you by the Bose A20 aviation headset, their most advanced pilot headset ever. I'm Larry Anglisano reporting for AvWeb at the AOPA Summit in Hartford. Now, touchscreen feature set has become the standard in modern avionics. Avidyne's here with their IFD 540, a touchscreen nav management system that's a direct replacement for the popular Garmin GNS 530. Here's Avidyne's Tom Harper. The IFD 540, what we're announcing at AOPA is the ability to do multi-touch on the touchscreen. As you know, with the IFD 540, it's a sliding replacement for your Garmin 530, and we've kept the knobs and buttons around the outside, which has some advantages, and we announced touch screen, but now here at AOPA, we're showing our multi-touch, which gives you the ability to do uh, pinch zoom, zoom in and out with two fingers, or using two fingers, you can pan the screen left or right and scroll around on the map. If you use a single finger on the touch screen, it'll give you information about different airports. As you zoom around and point here, it'll bring them up. So it'll differentiate between whether you want to pan or you want to uh, point at something. It makes the user interface much easier for the pilot. Uh, you obviously have the ability to range using the knobs, but now, again, in a, in a world with smartphones and, and uh, tablet PCs, we have the ability now, folks that are very familiar with this type of user interface can just reach up and zoom and pan around the map in a much easier fashion. Uh, the base price of the IFD 540 is $16,995.